Now let's discuss about refraction under RR medium. We now consider the refraction of a plane wave at a RR medium that is V2 greater than V1. Proceeding in an exactly similar manner, we can construct the refracted wavefront as shown here. So you can see it here. The refraction of a plane wave incident on a RR medium for which V2 greater than V1. The plane wave bends away from the normal. The angle of refraction will now be greater than the angle of incidence. However, we still have N1 sin i is equal to N2 sin r. We define an angle IC by the following equation that is sin IC is equal to N2 divided by N1. Thus, if i is equal to ic, then sin r is equal to 1 and r is equal to 90 degree. Obviously, for i greater than ic, there cannot be any refracted wave. The angle ic is known as the critical angle and for all angle of incident greater than the critical angle. We will not have any refracted wave and the wave will undergo what is known as total internal reflection.